Hi, this is Pastor Scott with a message about prayer. I've been getting a lot of questions about prayer, a lot of comments about prayer, and it's something that people have been asking me about basically since I started being a pastor. So folks want to know, you know, why does God answer some prayers and not others? Why does God sometimes answer the prayers of people that you might not expect and ignore the prayers of people that you might think God would answer? What is the deal with God and prayer? Well, it's an interesting topic because most of the time what we view as prayer is us telling God what we would like God to do. It is essentially a laundry list of the things that God has done wrong and that we think that if God just did it differently, things would be better. That's typically how most of us pray. We're just telling God what God's done wrong and what we know, well, if you just do this, God, things would be better. So let me tell you one kind of prayer that I've heard people pray that I've never heard of not being answered. Uh, and it, it comes uh, through partly our Bible verse, which I'm going to read for you now, which is Psalm 27, verse 4. It says, uh, One thing I asked of the Lord, one thing I asked of the Lord, that I will seek after, to live in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord, and to inquire in his temple. This is a prayer for God to show up in this person's life. One thing I asked of the Lord, that I will seek after, to live in the house of the Lord all the days of my life. Everyone I know who has prayed for God to be more present in their lives, to be more available and to, to communicate better and to just feel God's presence more. Everyone that I know that has prayed that and has sought for that has found it. That is the prayer that I am fully confident if you prayed that would be answered. And I don't know about the other stuff, right? I, I pray about other stuff. I pray for things all the time. I pray for people. I pray, pray for health. Uh, I pray for circumstances in the world. I pray for the wars that are going on. Pray for lots of things. Um, I, will God answer them? I don't know. Every time I lift up a prayer, I don't know what's going to happen, except for that one. If I pray to God, for God to be more present in my life, I know that that will come to pass. So I invite you to pray that, and let's pray that now. Let's begin our prayer time by getting comfortable. We'll take three deep breaths. God, help me to seek you and to seek your presence in my life more all the days of my life. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. That's all. I'll see you soon.